One, two, three, four, five. Woo! What's up guys, Jason Mar the Magician and welcome back to the 365 Days of Magic Challenge. Day number 107 and you might notice that things look a little bit different from the way that I usually film and the truth is, it's because your boy has a desk now. Now guys, today's magic trick is something that was inspired by Chris Ramsey. Now he didn't create the trick, but he did perform it on his channel recently and I totally thought to myself, I'ma do that trick, that's a good trick. So without any further ado, let's roll the stinger. And let's do a magic trick. So here we are back with the trick and for this you don't need the whole deck, you just need five cards. And these five cards are actually the ace, through to the five of spades, so that's pretty easy to keep track of. In fact, immediately after the ace would typically come the two. After the two, you would get the three, and then immediately after the four, you would actually get the five, unless you spun the five on one finger and snapped. And in that moment, it becomes the ace. What's even more crazy is that now you've got the two, the three, the four, and the five. Everything is completely reversed, and that is actually not a bad trick. Some would even say it's the best trick you've seen today. Some would say that. Not everyone, but some would. In fact, it's so good that I would be declaring myself the king. <laughs> I don't know why I threw that out, I just thought it'd be kind of cool. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed that trick, uh, I need to cite my sources, <laughs> give me a sec. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that trick. That trick was by Gabby Pierres. I hope I'm saying that right. I'm probably butchering it because I'm not very good at the French. It might not even be French. I might just be an idiot. <laughs> but anyway, guys, it is a good trick. It's quite easy to do. And I'm sure that if you're a magician, you've probably managed to work it out. So spare me your explanations in the comment sections below. Spare me your malcontempt, wench. <laughs> Now guys, I gotta be honest with you, it does feel good to be sitting at a desk. A lot of you wouldn't know this, but all of the videos up until today, I edited sitting cross-legged on the floor. Seriously, I'm, I'm not even kidding. That's how, that's how I did it. Now guys, that trick by Gabby Pierres is a, is a really nice little packet trick that you can just throw in uh, whenever you want. It's just impromptu, it's brilliant. That little switch at the end though, I came up with uniquely by myself but it's probably been published somewhere before, but it is a really nice little four for four switch, or in this case, five for four switch. <laughs> now guys, we are coming into the Christmas time. I've got my Christmas hat, I'm ready to rock and roll. Guess, can I do a magic trick with a Christmas hat? That would be kind of cool. Now guys, if you're still here, let me quickly show you this dope setup. I'm gonna switch over to the video camera on my phone. <laughs> Look at that. So I've got my camera in the ring light, okay? And that's a, uh, the computer's just below that. And then of course I've got the laptop next to that, don't ask me why. And then, sorry about the mess, there's a little bit of mess, a little grip trainer. And then you can see here, look at my little setup. There's my close up pad. I've got my blue Yeti microphone. There's my busking table. That is a piece of art that my wife made. <laughs> anyway guys, it really is truly refreshing to be able to sit down and make a video. You have no idea, sitting cross-legged on the floor, it's a tiled floor, it's a really <laughs> uncomfortable way to edit things, but you gotta do what you gotta do, man, when you love what you do and do what you love. Seriously, I made a, a video that I posted on Instagram, uh, it was like a short recap from the Omegle Adventures, it seems to be performing quite well, which is nice. It was the most comfortable I'd ever been while editing a video. <laughs> I heard an interesting thing from a YouTuber that I just <laughs> ran across. I don't even know who she is and I don't I didn't subscribe to her. I probably should have. She was interesting. Anyway, she said that YouTube is like making friends on like a bigger scale. So you can post out your content and maybe not a lot of people, in fact most people will not like what you do, but you get to scale out the people who do like what you do. And I know that even though I've got almost 3,000 subscribers, I know that there are almost 500 of you who religiously watch my videos and you guys are my bros, you guys are my friends, you guys rock and I appreciate each and every one of you. So I don't ever feel like the fact that you guys are so loyal and watching these videos is ever wasted on me. You know I appreciate each and every one of you and uh, I'm super grateful, I really am. But anyway guys, that's it for day number 107. It's a quickie, but it's a goodie. 
And I'll see you guys tomorrow for day number 108 and Christmas, man. I've got to come up with a Christmas-themed trick. <laughs> Big love, everybody. Big love.